And it's my so, birthday. I know. <laughs> our I'm together. nervous. That's awesome. No, don't be nervous. No. We're going to embarrass you no matter what, so don't worry about it. Yeah. Well, congratulations. <laughs> yeah. Congratulations on your wedding. Thank you. Way. I'm really good there. We're oh. still, still together. Yeah. Is she here with All you this on time your birthday? later. <laughs> that she may be. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, we might have to see her too. Okay. <laughs> All right. And also on your new uh, number one hit, Honeybee. Oh, very good. You. Is this kind of like, a, are you interviewing me? Yeah. <laughs> Is this like a job I'm interview? Very, I'm very nervous. Are you going for the you. morning show on the station? <laughs> yeah. Feel a little bit uh, nervous? Well, then she very nervous, there. yeah. yeah. And um, so where'd you go on your honeymoon? Well, we stayed at the house for about three days in Oklahoma. And then we went on down to uh, Cancun, Mexico, where I experienced uh, deep sea fishing, uh, sunbathing, and explosive diarrhea from drinking the water in Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> I also won a trip on my birthday, too. Did you really? Jamaica. Really? Have you gone yet? Not yet. I have a year to use it. So this is my lucky month. But you have all kinds of good friends all of a sudden. Don't you? Yeah. <laughs> A lot of girlfriends call him, but I have to take my son. He's 15. Oh, uh, so, yeah. that's good. I like that. Yeah. yeah. And Sorry. I watch your show, The Voice. You do? Oh, yeah. Do you vote for me? Oh, yeah. You like my girls on there? Yeah. Cindy and Dia? Yes, oh, I do. Me yeah. too. Me yeah. too. <laughs> and uh, I don't know. Anybody else have any other questions? <laughs> Speaking of The Voice, yeah. Tell us a little bit about some of the other coaches. Well, who gives a crap about the other coaches, honestly? But, well, if you really want to know. Well, he's the cutest. Uh, that's, let's see, yeah, there you go. I only pay attention to All right, so cutest for Blake. But my, my moves don't really compare to Christina's moves. You know oh. I mean, not, that is the duo. CeeLo yeah. looks pretty good, though, yeah. too, with that. CeeLo is the coolest human being I've ever met in my life. Yeah. And, and Adam is, a, is almost as big of a, of a smart ass as I am. Almost, not quite. Now, tell me, when you're doing like a medley of Queen songs, mm -hmm. and you look around, and there's Christina and CeeLo and Adam, do you think, well, what the hell am I doing? How did I get here? I do, man. I still, I mean, talking about it right now, it's like, did that really happen? It's crazy. It's a dream job, man, because I... And I've done it right here in uh, Indianapolis. I mean, I've got I used to go to karaoke bars and make an ass of myself. You know, I get to do that on national television with iconic singers, you know. And, and uh, it's just my dream job. I love it. And you guys signed up for another year already, I hear. Well, I think uh, I think everybody's coming back. Of course, you never know until, until it happens. But it, it looks like I think everybody will be able to work out their schedules. That's the trouble is uh, the four of us, we all have day jobs too, you know, and, and it's hard to... It's, it's nice when you know in advance and you can route your tour around it. That would probably be the only reason some of us couldn't, but I'd, man, I'd be heartbroken if I couldn't come back and do it again. Well, you got more than one day job, though. You're on tour. you got a new CD coming out this summer, mm -hmm. Newlywed. You're on the cover of every magazine every time I go to the store. That's not always good. <laughs> <laughs> Are you, you getting tired of seeing it? Leno. Uh -huh. You were even on oh, Jay Leno. Yeah, that was a good time. <laughs> I stayed up till 1 o'clock. Uh, I've been tired. Today I'm, I'm good. Last night uh, we started celebrating my birthday early and uh, Jared Neiman, he came up to me and said, hey man, for your birthday, I want you to take this Ambien. I said, I don't take that stuff. So I took an Ambien last night and I, I got the best sleep. I feel, I feel sorry for this crowd because I have so much energy built up from a good night's sleep that I'm, I may explode when I get on stage. Now I hear you can do things on Ambien that you're not aware of until other people yeah. tell you that you're doing them. Is that we think Jared was setting you up for that? Well, Did he follow you around with a video camera? We woke up together. I mean, uh, <laughs> you know, that's, that's cool to me, though. That's that's fine. Yeah. Well, happy birthday. We have a gift for you here. Yeah, yeah we do. It's, it's right behind you. you. There we go. There it is. What is it? It's a pink bag. What have you had? What have you done? Will you hold my drink? Thank you. Uh oh. Uh -huh. I want to see something I like here. <laughs> Better than Ambien. Oh. oh. Thanks from Hank FM. Wow. It's okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you, sweet. Thank you for so an outstanding much. interview. I'm sure yeah, many I radio tried. stations across the country will be calling you yeah. by the end of this week. Oh, I don't think so. <laughs>